can you solve this A-level integral? First, what we're going to need to do is times both the numerator and the denominator by 1 minus cos x. You'll see why later. We reach 1 minus cos x over 1 minus cos squared x. And we know by trig identities that 1 minus cos squared x equals sine squared x. We've now transformed this into a much neater integral, one of which we can actually work with. We can now split this fraction into 1 over sine squared x minus cos x over sine squared x. Well, we know that 1 over sine squared x is cos x squared x. And the second fraction is actually cos over sine times 1 over sine. Cos over sine is just cos x. 1 over sine is cos x. So now this is easily integrable. Integrable? <laughs> now, using your formula booklet, we can uh, now integrate this into minus cos x plus cos x plus the c. Don't forget the constant. And yeah, that's how you solve an A-level integral.